put away the mess, grab my put the boy, uh, feed Edgar, go to the kitchen to grab us. Yeah, alright. We need to find him. <laughs> You fucking, fucking motherfucker. Welcome back everybody to the useless Mr. Moon show, a horror show. And today we're going to play the game Lost Alone Chapter 3. The last one of all the games and I hope it's going to be the scariest game because it's about a grandma. We had... Played the first chapter about George, who had an alcohol problem and had to take care of someone, but he managed not to do it. The second one was how George's life was in the beginning, how he grew up, the scary parts in his childhood. It was insane. You should check both of them out. They're on the front page of my channel. Should really check them out, but ladies and gentlemen, we're not going to waste any more time. I'm really curious with this game. I can't wait because I've never played this game before. The other first two games I played but this one I didn't ladies and gentlemen if you're new here to the channel leave a like subscribe of course but for now <laughs> we're gonna get scared and I hope it really does are you ready I hope so let's go new game let's do it in English I think it's pretty hard to do it actually in Italian let's see if everything is correct everything is running it's always nice to check oh no I'm actually pretty scared to play this one, to be honest. This is really the last part. Press any key. Let's press enter. There we go. There are always weird paintings in them. Oh no, not this character. Ooh. There are no second chances. But despite this, everyone is looking for a second chance. Bro. A second chance to redeem oneself. Insane. Nice music. A second chance for love. A second chance to do better. Modern technology has become to so entranced that we live with the belief of formatting uh, when electronic gizmo reached the saturation we formatted it that's the bunny the white rabbit we start from the scratch and make the best use of it until the next formatting but life is straight line that goes on and on without stopping and on or formatting Thank you, strange uh, a little bit of stranger things <laughs> vibe I almost spoke Dutch there. There's no going back. Each experience accumulates with the others. That's the freaky creepy doll. You can try not to make the same mistakes, but you cannot format the ones you made by making the right choice with a new beginning. True. There are no second chances. Life's not, not a game where you can just reload from a better save. Well, we wish we could, right? We wish we could. Or is it? Well, the game is. I have my uh, beloved notebook here. As you know me. <laughs> Thank you. We always start in the dark room, but as you know, all know me, or you're new to the channel, I always have a notebook next to me because I like to write stuff down, especially with these kind of games. Hello. Ah, that statue is definitely gonna move. As I said, the, the previous two episodes I played in the beginning of my channel, the beginning of the start of my recording career, if you can say it like that, and I always had troubles with it. That's why I wanted to play it over, and the, the new game came out, but I ha heard that the game is a lot similar to this, these three, so we're first gonna play these three completely. Well, we did two of them already, and we will see in the future when we're gonna play the new one, maybe a couple weeks, maybe let this one sink in a bit. But I never played this game before, ladies and gentlemen. So, no scare that I know. No corner that I know. We will get scared pretty easily, I guess. Oh, shit. I just wasted it. Oh, freaking out. Well, because we played it so many times, we know... Oh, no, so many times. That's not what I'm Okay, we have oil again. We don't have a flashlight. That's a shitty thing. Pick a jukebox coin. All right. 
So we know that we're gonna uh, grab a lamp somewhere soon. An oil lamp. Oh. We grab lots of cobra. Her passion for animals is pathological. Alright. So we're gonna grab as, as many things as possible. Try to search for every corner. Then we put it in the duffel bag somewhere. And then we keep on going. That one's locked. That's the light switch. There's sometimes a small thing that can hold us for like 60 hours in the game. Or is just maybe one of the closets that we did not check. A wooden plank blocks the opening. Takes some of the force. Okay, so we know that we have to pick up a crowbar somewhere. But I don't know where. Let's pick up, take up the pills. At least take one already. I know it's a bit of a waste. Leave it like this. Alright, so what do we have here? Wait, is it the Kenzo story? Yeah, well, we we read this completely. I'm not going to do this right now. So I'm not for, up for it. We read this completely. I don't know if we read this one, though. Ooh, but yeah, okay. So, um, it's just a little a bit of a side story here. There. Nothing much important, I guess. Maybe if you're really a lore lover. Well, I, pl I play this just for the game, and the game has to tell me the as much possible lore. I read every note, of course, believe me, but I read these notes already. Um, in the previous game, uh, for instance, if you wonder, okay, um, I, I actually want to know. Then you should watch the previous episode, you can find them in my whole video. But I will, right now, leave it up for a bit like this, because I think I did not read this one. But I'm not going to read it right now, otherwise I have to read the complete story. So, you can pause it right now, if you want to. Um, what I actually can do for you is do this. Alright, you can pause it right now. Next one. Alright, you can pause it right now. Next one. You can pause it right now. <laughs> Next one. <laughs> this was my idea. Though. I do like I'm agitated by your decision. Alright. Pause it. Alright. And then last one. We already did that one. Now it's easy. Alright, so you can read it now for yourself. Just have to pause it a little bit there. Okay, aquarium. Sin's room. I think we have to go upstairs. Hallway. Better get a flashlight first. You mean a lamp. We can't run in the game. Besi uh, unless we get a um, energy drink. Not from Red Bull. Emma? Oh, fuck no. <laughs> no, not immediately. Be aware, there are a lot of really good jump... Well, good... Nasty jump scares in the game. Just, just, let's go to her. Green shot. Elsa, tried to get a move on. George. Ah, Elsa was the grandma. Grandma? Is she floating? I've thought you a thousand times, you're not my grandson. You've always been an insufferable little boy. Oh, yeah. From Alberto, right? That's what she thinks. Excuse me, grandmother. Your apology is more useless than you are. Haha, <laughs> useless Mr. Moons. It's us. Did you do what I asked you to do? No, grandma, I did not. What did you ask me to do? Holy shit, George. How many times do I have to tell you? You have a series of tasks to do. Grandma's creepy. I've left notes for you around the house. Get a move on. Oh, sh... Why do I say shit, you wonder? Because the first game did not have a... Um, chase feature in it. It was without a chase. Second game, there was kind of a butcher there. That was following us sometimes. I think Grandma... We'll scare us soon. Definitely. Ooh, that's a weird painting, man. This room room is locked. We need follow grandma, maybe? Nope. Start the jukebox. Alright, you know what? Let's do it. I just inserted a coin. Wait a minute. Start the jukebox, yeah, well, I just inserted the coin. 
we have a problem already immediately? What was that? To start over. I wouldn't like that so much though, to start over immediately. Oh, a flashlight. Jesus. Hello? Anybody here? Ah, a coin, nice. So we don't have to start over yet. Oh, this game is gonna be so creepy. Leave the light on. Yeah, I don't know why the game is sometimes spawning in, see? So late, I don't know why. Maybe because it's actually not made for ultra. So we're gonna put it on high. There, you don't, won't see much of a difference, but maybe it keeps on. No, it's not. <laughs> it keeps on loading it in though. Okay, that's George's room. <gasps> oh, you motherfuckers. There we go. But I haven't seen such a scare in the game though. George, this is room. Oh, I wanna see the new Evil Dead though. Nice dead, it's called. Examine. Non space invasion arca arcade cabinet. E. Let's grab it. Okay, so we need to find some cubes. Put the toys away. Um. No, we don't need it yet, so. Jesus, that's scary, man. Come on. Alright. Susan, the girl who will help me take care of Grandma, arrived today. I didn't expect her to be so young and pretty. She might be two or three years older than me. She took this job because she has to pay for medical studies. I hope grandma will be good to her. The last person who came to help us disappeared into thin air. But I can understand her. It's not easy at all to take care of grandma and her illness. It's also difficult for me. But I can't leave. George. Alright. I think we're a bit older already. Before actually... I think the chronological order of the game is... Is... Um, oh, going... 2, 3, and then chapter 1. I think that's the chronological order. That's creepy, man. Waiting. Yeah, me too, bro. Yeah, yeah I don't have any key card yet, so we have to do something here. Makes sense. I want to get scared. That is still always creepy. Always creepy. How? What? Why am I throwing all my coins away? This is to grab my room key. Oh, 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 oh. No. We don't want to do that though. There you go. Grandpa. Yeah. Oh, it is so good. The flashlight guides you. Yeah, we still have to find the flashlight though. Well, grandma magically disappeared. But it was a good, a good update from the from the developers for this game that they used these old mechanics for the door, in my opinion. Water the plant. I like these notes, though. First game was really hard to find sometimes. Why did we have oil? Batteries. Nice. Maybe we have two kinds of... Alright, locked. I'm, I'm really gonna save my flashlight though, because the thing is, with the flashlights, it's also losing power over time. So, we have a, a bar for light, but as soon as it gets less in the bar, it also gets less power out of it, so. George, the doctor advised me to write down as much as I can. This should help with me uh, with my illness. Unfortunately, at the moment, I can only count on you. I need you to give me a hand. You have a number of tasks to do. You have to take care of this house for me. What are my plans? Take pictures of all my animals. I want to see if the if they are okay. Take the pictures to my room. Fix up my mannequin. No. Oh, no. Someone left all the pieces lying around. Put your things away. I don't want to see them lying around. 
<laughs> but my mom said that back in the days, put your thing away. <laughs> I know what that meant. Take my medicines to my room. Play the jukebox. I want to hear my favorite song. Put the fish in the aquarium. I get nervous with nervous with the mess. You always leave everything lying around. I'm sick of hearing you said it's not you scattering things around the house. And who should it be? There are two of us here. Get a move on, George. Greetings, Elsa. All right. Put it away. Thank you. Something um opened up somewhere. I think maybe this was this closet. Purple fish. Can we actually we put three coins in already? Nothing is happening. Alright, so we're gonna save we have enough light here. He's spawning in. What do we have though? Well, we've got better to put them in the aquarium. Where's the aquarium though? I haven't seen it yet. Something in the bathtub. A coin, nice. Wait, what is that? Okay, it's grand. Oh, I did. I completely missed it though. Okay, save the light. Let's check one more time. Oh, jeez. I did not see this closet at all. Medicine. See, we. During the playthrough, we pick up a lot of stuff. Light. Leave it open. Where's the save button, actually? No, uh, an old model of other race. It still works. Such a good movie. Shining is amazing. What's that weird sound? Alright. Bring her the medicine. We're gonna do that, though. I really have no clue where we have to drop it all off. This is what we can... We should put... Well, you know what? I'm gonna... The first check is actually start the jukebox. I think something went wrong, though. Put the medicine. How many medicine do you need? Four of them, alright. Photograph animals. Okay. I think we need to find a coin still somewhere. Maybe we need so many coins. I don't know how big this house is. No clue. <laughs> That's creepy, man. <gasps> oh, no. Grandma's love. Oh, that looks really creepy. At the tender age of 11, George met love. Aww. A smothering love. Wrong love. The love that no one should ever know. With his mother deaf and his father sentenced to the electric chair. Holy crap. George was placed in the care of the paternal grandmother, Elsa. He fucked up. Elsa loved George. He loved George in a way that no child should ever be loved. Oh. What the little boy couldn't yet understand. Raised in a denial, Elsa's morbid attachment was a synonym for acceptance. A symbol of... Oh, we already had that one. A symbol of attachment that somehow kept George from running away from that home. 1982. Elsa abuse was stopped by Alzheimer's. Ooh. She abused him. The semblance of love dispensed by Elsa was completely replaced with unreasonable anger and George attached to his grandmother forced him to take care of the old woman. Why? Hmm. 
memory loses, angry outbursts and moments of panic were made lighter by Susan. Caretaker? Susan was a medical student who, to pay for her own studies, agreed to take care of Elsa moving into the house. But well, she probably dead. <laughs> well, Susan's room is upstairs, though. Um, there's somewhere a hallway button. Hell, why is it called hell? Oh, sh We don't have batteries for this, man. Where's the light switch? Let's turn that one on. There's a light switch, nice. Game saves. In Lost Alone uh, Episode 3, Granny, you can save your game progress by interacting with the video recorders. You will need the VHS to save. If they wait the right time, don't waste them. Well, that's a stupid, stupid change in the game. That's actually one of the few things that I really liked about the game. The previous games. You just pass by, save, and then... Oh, shit. Alright, so we now we need to really think of it. Okay. The red key card. Sure, why not? What's it? The toy. Coin. No inventory space. Where's the duffel bag? Or was I one here, right? No, 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 I need to double back. Purgatory, oh, this is going to be a long game. Oh, so the exit is here, all right. This is enough light for now. There's a node here. Uh, I know there's a coin there, so we should mind ourselves. Maybe there's a double back in the kitchen. Yes, there is. There's also a light source. Edgar eats worms, insects and lizards. We have so much to do. Hello Edgar. Grab my scroll, it looks hungry. Better not get your hands on it. Alright, so what are we gonna do? Oh, I hate this whole mechanic with saving. Probably see that we don't have enough. Um, we're gonna sh no. We're gonna, no. We're gonna take the uh, use, use, and then we're gonna store the pills. Yeah, we're gonna store this one as well. Okay. Oh, nice. Batteries. Very welcome. Coin. Let's put everything away. I think that's really the way to go. Uh, yeah. Store. It's shit that we have to cost continuously be in this um, in this inventory. Well, it, it's, it has to be done. <laughs> what? 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 What did I miss? I'm instantly sweating though. Alright. January 10th, 1982. Today's the first day in this house. Mr. Elsa alternates between moments of lucidity and moments of total confusion. I did not know she had a grandson about my age. He seems like a nice boy. I'm sure we will get along very well in the coming months, Susan. Ho oh, ho, you will. Oh, actually we should save maybe, but yeah, I don't want to waste it, as it said, we should not. Alright, we have a red key card, there's nothing here that we can do. What happened actually? I We missed it, well at least I missed it. Switch it off. 
Two coins, nice. Uh, what's that duffel bag somewhere here? You know what? We can go in here. What's that? No, just two, just two blue cards upstairs. Can explore a little bit. There will be a wooden mask, all right. There will be a time that we are getting stuck, though. I kind of forgot that was a jump scare game. Go to the kitchen to get grandmother's key. Where was the kitchen again? You know what? We have the medicine. Coin. Not a coin. So much stuff. Holy crap the moly. It's insane. Not gonna save yet though. You know what? At least I'm gonna save once. What we should do. Okay. Go to the kitchen. Put away the master grammar. Put the boy. Uh, feed Edgar. Go to the kitchen to grab us. Yeah, alright. We need to find. Ah! The You fucking fucking motherfucker. Use my language there. Use my language there. Oh, I'm sorry I had to accept there. I normally don't do that often though, but woo! <laughs> that heartbeat is pounding. Woo, my god. It's n that was a nasty jump scare. For my diehard followers, sorry Serena, that made you jump probably. <laughs> I hope you're not drinking any coffees though. My god, why would you do that? Such a jump scare, Jesus. If Still need more. Alright. I'm completely lost what I was doing. Where was the duffel bag? Can we actually open this right now? No, we can't. Where's the duffel bag here? Did we find a toy already? No, right? Or did we? Yeah, a toy. Oh, there we go. That's gone. We're definitely gonna need that, need that later. Um... Go to, let's go to grandma's room actually and store these ones as well and whoa actually i should um oh use these ones there was actually a big drop in sanity there did not pay attention to it all right this is gonna be a long long game love it so many things to do oh i'm not finally settling down there a bit As I said before, mostly I try, uh, try to save up as many things as possible and then actually do them, but I know that we just need two more of these boxes. Wait. Oh, we need way more. All right, damn it. Fucked up there. Sure. Let's explore then a little bit more. Was this somewhere? No, a red key card, not more. No, 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 no. That's a green. Oh, no, that's a red key card. That's not a red key card. So creepy. Can we actually go into these doors already? Hello, bud. Somewhere in here, maybe. Get Kodomo and enjoy the game, yeah. Well, I'm not gonna get anything if you keep on scaring me like that.
Oh. There's something moving there. Oh, is that the aquarium? Oh yeah, that is. Second hallway. Holy crap, how big is this game? A mechanism blocks it, alright. I never really understood what that sound was in all the games. Go. Oh. There is a light source here, right? It's not really helping that much. Return the fish to the aquarium. We don't have a fish. Oh, wait, we do actually. I don't know many, how many fish we do have to do this, but alright. We'll see. Oh, not gonna waste light. It has been more than a week now. George and I spend a lot of time together. We have a lot of interest in, and in, in, uh, uh, we have a lot of interest in common. We like the same movies, the same music, etc. However, whenever I ask questions about his past, he immediately becomes somber and changes the uh, subject. I don't know what he's been through, but apparently it's a topic of limits to him. If he lives with his grandmother, he must have lost his parents in a bad accident. Uh, yeah, but it was a horrible accident. I wonder. I won't bring up the subject again unless he tells me about it. Susan, that's very nice of you, Susan. But I hope you're still alive. Fishes. Okay, okay. Prepare yourself for jump scare. Hmm. <sighs> Not gonna waste waste good energy there. Okay. Empty, I mean. I'm stuck. In these rooms, we should have found something already. I did not check this one. Though. Okay. I completely sometimes just forget to check these these closets. Door still locked. It's the exit. All right, so there's one more door here. Where where can it be? That we have to go. I have to find a book though somewhere. Oh, uh, the, of course. We have to go to the kitchen to get Grandma's tea. That's what we can do. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Each insects, worms, and lizards. <laughs> okay. Um, we have a mushroom. We can actually. Okay, we have checked everything here. So we're gonna grab the tea. We're gonna go out. Yeah, 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 yeah. Where do we have to bring it? Where was that again? Is there no... Uh, what do you call it? A light switch in the hallway? A hallway light? Wait, it was that room, right? Grab my key, please not scare me like you did before. The key, thank you. Wait, did I completely miss that key? I hope I did not. Wait, it said something. I know I'm gonna hate this game. <laughs> we have to go to Purgatory. It's completely back in the hallway, right? Completely at the end, Ross. Was it? Uh, yeah. Take the shortcut. There's not a living room. But there's a key to the living room there, right? 
No, that was somewhere else. Oh, that's where I came from. Never mind. Sometimes I like to play in these kind of houses. Sometimes it's just freaky. And I want to quit. Hello, George. Oh, that's Gonzo. We finally meet in person. That's from the letter. So if you really want to know, read it. My name is Gonzo and I'm, I'm one of the four demons. The demon of purgatory. Yeah. Change things vibe here. Until now, we have only gotten to know each other through letters. Oh. Eat. Now your journey is coming to an end and we have gathered in this place to decide what to do with you. You do you, mate. Oh, fuck you up. To my grandmother's house. Don't be silly, George. Don't be silly. This is the house of your childhood only appearance. In appearance, alright. But you know where to be found. You're dead, George. Remember? Oh, yeah. yeah. Chapter 1. You are in a, you are in a no place. You are suspended in kind of a limbo. Or purgatory. Why am I here? Why me? Well, George asked. I am here to judge you. The final judgment is the path I chose when I sacrifice Yoko. Let's keep it short, George. <laughs> Judy boy. You are in this place for a final judgment. Your life has been very particular, George. Oh, uh... Very particular. And we, d and we demons are trying to figure out how much you are actually in re responsible for the trail of death that you left behind. A lot. I don't understand. Relax, you don't have to understand, George. You must please us demons. <laughs> what way? Let's start with a simple, simple task. Here, Grandma. I spent my existence chasing an unrequired requited love. I wanted Yoko's heart at all costs, but when I was presented with a choice, I gave up love. Who's Yoko in this story, then? Now I am in the possession of Yoko's heart. And, I can, and it can finally be inside me forever. Cook me a love soup, George. You will find the recipe in the kitchen. What the fuck are you talking about? What is a love soup? Yeah, I just want to ask. George, 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 George. No questions. There are me metaphors. Just do it. Follow the recipe and then come to me to get Yoko's heart. Right? Can we put that away? I'm gonna make a screenshot. Nice. Maybe it's good for thumbnail. Alright, let's quickly take a good look in here. Ah, videotape. There's something else here. We might need to change the batteries there. You can't go there. Alright. Excuse me. Just <laughs> that's so mean. For the people that did not see it. There you go. Alright, you got away. Who is the rabbit woman? Yeah, Yoko maybe. Garlic, onion, mushroom, tomato sauce, potato, pepper and grains, pepper and salt. This is such a weird game. It's so out of order with the previous uh, chapters. Scares are the same, but... Alright. Thank you. 
Or we might need to go to hell later. Okay. <sighs> Put away the mesh in grandma's room. Yeah, I know. We have another fish fish. Feed Edgar. Return to the fish. Put the fish in. I don't know how many fish we need to put in. On the way as well. We might leave. Well, I'm gonna keep that one with me. The mechanism is blocking it. What can we put away though? I'm kind of stuck here, to be honest. So we have a basement. Yay. Fun. Fun. I love it already. The amount of things that we have to do is actually kind of overwhelming. We have nothing more, right? Oh no. What didn't I check? We checked everything in his room. We checked everything in the kitchen. We might need to go here again. Fun thing is, it might be somewhere a key laying around. Just for fun. No logic is sometimes in this game presentable, but, uh, you know. Hmm. No key. Wait, there is something underneath the snake box. <laughs> okay, there's another fishy. Um, I'm gonna put immediately the fish away because I have no clue how many, as I said, how many we have to do. might help us maybe this one already no it didn't damn it all right then we, i think we have to go back here let's see i found just found the last fish fish i hope it's the last fish fish ah there we go i found the last fish fish okay so we can continue right now let's see I've been wandering around for a couple minutes, so uh, was would have been very boring for you guys. Ha! Ah, key. Uh, but I, I missed one of these drawers again, so you did not miss anything. It was uh, in a room that we passed 60 times already. The wooden plank. Alright, so we have now... Which stuff? The tailoring key. Where is that door? Where was that? There must be a duffel back here, right? Yes. Uh, put this one away. Uh, but I don't think we need this one still. I'm gonna put it away for a bit. Tailoring it. Alright, we're gonna... Second hallway. Tailoring key. Since... Ooh, I think that's one of the... Uh, other rooms that we hear. I'm gonna speak to one of the demons. Paradise's basement. Okay, there was living room, I believe. That's not it. Right, where can it be? There was one more door in the hallway, and it was hell, right? Was there another door next to it? This is Susan's room. And there were no other doors here, right? No, because that was my room. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Oh. Gonna check out the first the door in the hallway. Let's see. Otherwise, I might know where we have to go. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I 
I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry about that. Oh, I had there a special moment for a sec. I pressed all kinds of buttons at the same freaking time. Oh, Jesus Lord. I'm sorry about that. Wait, wait we can't change it. Very nice. Hmm. Oh. Oh. Well, this actually scared me more than the freaking jump scare. Crowbar. Nice. Now we can continue for a bit. A book. Alright. Nice. Such a mannequin. Shit. As soon as we know that we need the, 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 the energy drink, something will come chase us soon. Fix the mannequin. I will. Put the oil away. Definitely need that one. And that one. Alright. Ooh, yeah, 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 yeah. I wish I could see that scare properly though. Ah, salt. Ooh. Pepper and grains, I mean. Really pay attention to what we pick up. Time is in the house goes by quite fast. Thanks to George, of course. Although he is three years younger than me, I feel a very strong bond with him. In a little less than a month, I, it will be his birthday. I want to get him a nice present. The joy I felt with George I cannot share with Elsa as well. I know and I know and understand her illness perfectly, but there is something dark about that woman. Even in moments of lucidity, she exudes a very bad side. When she is confused, she squints and becomes very violent. She has a morbid attachment to animals. It is as if she has makeup for a kind of a mother hen syndrome. Okay. But take care of the other creatures. George and I decided to take away her ability to use the phone. Today, a package arrived with the snake that Elsa ordered by calling the pet store. <laughs> All right. Yeah. All right. We're definitely going to get chase here. Or in that house, maybe. Grandma's probably walking around. Yeah, there we go. A key to what? Basement key. Oh. Shit. I'm so tired. So many energy drinks. You know what? I'm immediately gonna save at these ones here. Yes, that feels good. Good, good, good. Alright. Um, we need the key. We have the pepper. There was a duffel bag somewhere here. There was a duffel bag. There it is, there it is. There. But yeah, we definitely gonna need to run. And you know what? That made me help a lot though. I'm gonna put it on two. Store. Oh, that's for the soup. You know what? We don't have all the things yet. We can place the book already. We can take that one with us. You know what? If we have it with us, we can just better do this as well. We're gonna save that one. I don't know why we have oil in the game yet, but... We might need it later. We definitely need it later. Basement key. All right. Still a shame that we missed that. That I missed that scare. There was nothing there that we could be opened. Oh, I left it on again. See? Don't waste good light. All right, we don't need it here. And probably light switch off right about now. She's in the basement, ladies and gentlemen. See, there are so many freaking... We're at least gonna drink it already. As soon as we have to escape, we have it. We 
have another save. That's good. But we save right now. Uh, there's one drawer here as well. I think we can basically go to the basement, right? Alright, the mannequin part here. It's in place, but it does not take off. Alright, it is... Pity. I actually should have saved after I opened everything. I'm definitely gonna do this anyway. Gonna go up because I think we ha might have a problem in the basement. It's running. There are drawers here still to be opened, see? Um, something here now. So. In our rooms, there's still one to be opened. Was one here? No, it wasn't here, right? No. All right. All right. So much stuff. Holy crap! Look at this. Insane. How many medicine do we have? Ooh. We almost got there though. Let's put this one away. This one as well. So we have enough space. And then we go into the basement. But first I want to save. Where was the that we could? Ah. Nice. Now we're going to do that as well. And then we go into the basement. That's still creepy. Uh, the reason why I do this actually, ladies and gentlemen, is that as soon as we die and we have to start over, we have to do this completely over. Yeah, I'd rather risk it with one more. Ooh. Yeah, let's first put the medicine away. Safe, where was the closest safe? Oh yeah, I know where it was. Aha! Finally! Fonzie. We yeah, unlocked an achievement. I don't always see the achievements though. <laughs> right. See? What is in there? Show me. Cool. Probably jump scare soon. Connect to the photos, alright. Uh, oh, oh! You're weird. You're gonna close the door? By the way, that was pretty loud. <laughs> What just happened? Besides me kicking my foot against the wall and a freaking loud scream. What the heck happened? Oh. Oh. Completely lost what we were doing. <laughs> I need a duffel bag and I need safe spot I think a duffel bag was in this room no I'm wrong but there is a safe spot oh no one here ah alright door Jesus That scared me to... That scared the shit out of me. Which is my sound though. Alright, so we can actually... 
do all the water thingies. That's the first. I'm gonna do that as well. We need to do it later anyway. Alright, where's the other one? Let's do it room by room, you know? One there. That one here? No, but I don't think actually we have to do it yet because in the other rooms that we did not open yet, there are plenty of them in, in them as well. Oh, I should not run that much though. <laughs> I did not save yet, I know. Just, just I want to do everything before we can actually continue and then I want to save. Because with the other games, we could just save as many times as possible. Alright, so is there one here? No, this is just that one. Alright. Needs a green card. You have a thing to fill up, mate? I kind of forgot that you were actually in the house. <laughs> Peace. You don't need the flashlight yet. Let's see. We need that, but I already found the head. And whether we're just doing the water thingies. Plants. <gasps> you. Blood the hell, eh? That's gonna be pretty good. I have to say. I need to take a break from horror games maybe a little bit. Ladies and gentlemen. It might kill me one day. We did this one. We do this room. Nothing is moving secretly behind me. Oh, there is one actually here. What the heck? I think everyone has one. Let's go up. Wow. That mannequin. Jesus Lord. I hope he saves your and my soul. Close your eyes and keep them shut I'll go to sleep but won't wake up <laughs> Hush little baby, don't say a word Mama's gonna catch you a mockingbird And if that mock Bird won't sing. You don't Break have to Birdie's neck is what Eminem said. For if that mocking bird is swift, Mama's gonna bring you another. I love this game. Gift, a heart of red, a knife of bread. It's really too loud for me. It hurts my eardrums. So why were you here? Excuse me. Lady, I did not save yet. I don't want to die. Where the fuck is the door? The door has disappeared. Um... I see. <laughs> oh, 
What is it saying? Who is the the rabbit woman? Yeah, I don't care, man. Who the rabbit woman is? I just want to get out of life. Who moved the ball? Yeah, because it was upstairs in my room. You yeah, please calm the f down, mate. By the way, it's such a very weird game. <coughs> well, by far, this game has the cheapest freaking bloody hateful jump scares in, out of all three games. Oh, I'm spontaneously sweating though. Why did I do that? I don't know. Yeah, I was still busy actually with watering the pants. <laughs> that made me completely forget what I was doing. There's one other. I think we did everything upstairs though. Alright. Are we gonna... I'm gonna go into that room. And then we're gonna save and we're going into the basement. Because I think there's nothing more to do here right now. I'm gonna save here. Don't you think that's a good idea? Yeah, I think so too. Thank you. That mannequin still, man. I hope you're enjoying. Ladies and gentlemen, if you're still enjoying me in this video, let me know. And if you're new here, please leave a subscribe and like, of course. Otherwise, why, why would you watching a hour and ten minutes already? Jesus. Time flies when you have fun. We get scared very easily. Well, why, why do we have to pick up this book? Mostly something happens. Um, this is not called the basement. I expect way more. <laughs> ah, red key card. Shit. Off a back somewhere? No. All right, I'm gonna grab it quickly. Now, I actually wish that we. Checked it beforehand. I'd rather be safe though. Alright. Um Red key card, that's what we need. That's purple, alright. I thought it was red though. What's in here? A safe, nice. The X files. Stupid, stupid jump scares. Horror story. Just I just read horny, but okay. Carnage of the future. Or of the or of the galaxy. <laughs> An incredible thing has happened. Susan and I. I can't write this because of how excited I am. It was a beautiful thing. Could could this be love? After what we did, I finally felt good. What was happening with Grab? I was wrong. Terrible wrong. But I've. But I was not at fault. I was too young to understand. Fortunately, Grab must also put a stop to it. I must try to get the past and focus on Susan. That's what George wrote. Yeah. Um, okay, this is good to know that the light source is here. We're probably gonna need it later. But there's no other light source in here. Let's watch it. It's gonna switch off. Oh, okay. Now I'm actually stuck with <laughs> what we should do. Oh man. We already did the fish, but there's a dove back here, so. Um, store. Can we actually already make it? You know what? I'm gonna try. Um. What can we put away? We can put away the crowbar for a while. Don't need it yet. So otherwise we can always pick it up. We can put that one away. We definitely can put this one away because we don't need it yet. And um, we still need a head and a hand. So fishy. Um Where could we make? Oh, what's that again? 
There's no. Where was it? Where was it? Oh yeah, there it was. Plotty mannequin. Yeah, I. That was a really good scare. Silent, quietly, and well timed. Still need garlic potato salt, but we, at least that's what I like that they scratch it out. Alright, so garlic, it's here, right? Why can't we pick that up? Ah! Potato. Is that the one? It's potato. He eats worms, insects, so we can't get there yet. Maybe we can already put up some... ...of these arms. Just do it. You annoying cunt. I'm getting so aggressive, I don't know why. <laughs> it's so easy. Well, I'm also from a part of Holland, or the Netherlands for you guys. That actually uh, also really curse a lot. For us it's really normal. It's not a way of an excuse, but it's just happening. Ah, okay. So now it finally opened up. Um, I thought we, we did fill this one up, but um, it did not. Because I was distracted by the woman in the bathtub. <laughs> it's a... Uh, it's, uh, I should actually, but <laughs> well, that's the thing I missed. It uh, took me about 30 minutes to actually um, find that. So we're going to the cabinet that opened up, but I, I can't remember the cabinet that broke opened up. Cabinet opened up. What is it? That one now? Wait, that needs a key card. No cabinet there. This one is opened. In the this one then yeah it's nice 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 so we can continue take a picture of Edgar take a picture of the cat take a picture of the fish shit that's going to be a little bit of a problem Notebook there. Alright. Oh, I don't know why we need the carrot for. But definitely we need the other stuff. Every time I've seen it, there's a jump scare coming. Mean, mean jump scares. Alright, so what do we need to make a picture? Take a photo. Of okay, take a picture of the gecko. Alright, here. What is that sometimes going through me? My shoulder, maybe? Yeah, go right. Okay, nothing really weird is happening. That's good. Until <laughs> now. Take a picture of the snake. Who's Edgar, by the way? Who the fuck is Edgar? I now wonder out of nowhere. I said his name three times, but... Oh, Edgar is gonna scare the shit. Are you Edgar? Take a picture of the cat. Take a picture of the fish. The fish fish is here. Who the F is Edgar? Are you Edgar? And say... Who took that picture? I did not press it. I want to say, say cheese. Take a picture of Edgar and take a picture of the cat. What cat? What cat? I haven't seen a bloody cat, mate. 
There must be a painting somewhere where there's a cat though. Where have you seen a cat? I think we have to go into the hallway again. The big hallway. This is nothing really here, I guess. Edgar's not here. Okay, there's an either. Maybe the cat is in my room. It's possible. Slowly we are doing our missions. I like that. Cat, where are you? Catty Vetty, where are you? Hey. Crazy game. Don't get me wrong. These are not the best horror games out there. But they're definitely good. There are a lot of puzzles in there. Good storylines, I think. Yeah, well, I, I appreciate storyline. Not the best, this, this, this. But the jump scares, some of them are mean, man. Sometimes you just need a game to play. Like this, you know? Played old. Easy jump scares. You might get one soon. Edgar, are you here? Nay. Nay, Edgar is gone. Freaking knew it! Where are you, Edgar? Edgar? Where are you? This actually makes the game way easier that he's sitting there. But I really like the story about Kenzo. Well, you could see it in the beginning. You can read it. Where the heck is Edgar, man? Oh, this is Edgar. Of course. Where's the mannequin? It's... <laughs> I thought the medic was Edgar though. <laughs> Where's the kid? Oh yeah, where's Edgar as well? Uh, I mean the mannequin. Edgar is the, the crow, of course. Well, yeah, we haven't seen the cat yet, so we can't proceed in that way. Because I think the cat is maybe here. One of the few doors that we can't, op uh, can't open yet, or we did not open. Oh, we also have the green doors. Of course, the cat may be in here. There, the gecko was here. I don't think it's there in the same room. All right, all right, all right, all right. Take a photo, grab my room. But how to feed Edgar, though? I'm now really stuck. Before I had an idea of what I can do, now I don't. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm a bit, bit confused what I can do right now. Um, I will see you in a bit. Otherwise, you are going to sit here for a long, long time and you don't want that. So, in a bit. Uh, as soon as we took... Let me put this all away. I cookies in the meantime. <laughs> I'm sorry. I was angry. Um, after taking the picture though, um, I went through the whole house. After also that I thought maybe... We got some usual thing out of that closet we just saw before. Um, 
but about 10 minutes later I went by all the animals again and I could pick up this up because on the note of the bird set um, that's the fucking mannequin I think he's supposed to run towards me it looked like it because oh there are you uh, bro there are the Oh my good lord, I just had to pick up the gecko. So as I was saying, I went by here a couple times. And there was the the letter that the, what the, uh, the, the, the bird eats. And I, there was sending a lizard. And I thought like, okay, I, I did not find the other things. The only lizard that was that gecko that was sitting there that we took the picture of. So, yeah, you know. I, uh, I tried to take it and then I picked it up. And then I thought like, okay, I did not say a word for like 10 minutes. So... I have to explain to you guys, but now we can continue. Let's make a picture of you, though. There we go. <coughs> Fuck you. Jesus, why? Okay, let's potato. Let's do this. Wait, was that a demon? Jesus. Was it a... Oh, no. You know what? I'm gonna take a risk here. Gonna save. You have an arm, though. So we can do multiple stuff right now, right? Multiple stuff. You can do the next arm. Do that. Wait. Wait, thank you. We don't need this now. He said that I did not see that red thing on my on my days. Combine. Kinda forget that you're playing a hard, uh, hard, uh, hardcore. Play a horror game after a while when you look for so, so long. Alright, let's open this one. But yeah, for you guys, it's just pure instant. Instantaneously. Also, a bit out of words, though. <laughs> I'm a bit tired. Alright, so we have a toy. Let's put it away because we still need another one. But what we can do, though is um take the picture where's the picture of the cat though grab the picture of the cat and actually go upstairs into grandma's room and see what's in that closet over there um gonna use a little bit of speed here hope a key i really do hope a key Vegetable stock is ready, all right. Let's pick this up. Martha is alive. Martha's dead. That's a good game, though. Pick up a red gem for what? All right. Do we still need the camera? No, right? Um, so let's store it, then. Let's store it on our way to, uh, to pick up. Soup. Well, why did the dude leave the heart to us? The demon just went away, left the heart. But we still have to bring him his soup. Oh, I haven't had. Ah, uh, all right. This might be. This can be a possible end though, because I read before I started the game. I read there are multiple endings though. But I'm not gonna exp explore that. I'm replaying the way we play it. It's the nice things of these games with different endings. Because the thing is, if I want to play a different ending, and it has to do with something that we start in the beginning of the game, we can just play it over another day. You know? And we know the beginning, just have to do something else than we actually did right now. Super's not ready, it's way better to do something else, alright. 
Uh, there's a duffel bag over there. Still have a feeling that grandma's coming soon. Why were there so many energy drinks? Um, let's store this one. Seems to get somewhere. Can we do? Where can we put this one? We don't need the camera anymore. We need to open something right now to actually proceed with maybe a different key card or something like that, right? No, the lights went out. I don't have a challenge. But the 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 energy the the the, the. yeah, I know. But leave me be. We don't have the key yet. Oh, now we might be in, in trouble though. Yeah, we fucked up. Rip, ma. <laughs> Why? I said so before. Crap, I probably still coming. Quickly bring it to the demon though. Not gonna wait any more time here. Ah. Phew. A key, what is this? Strange old dagger. It emits heat. Right. Ah. Alright. Put away the demon masks. Pretty cool. I know where to put the mess though. Pretty cool guy, but hard to find some stuff. I also wonder how there are multiple endings though. Would it be a shame though to do that actually? Because it worked towards one end. Let's put immediately the mask away. Why, why, why wait? See, why wait? What can we do with this though? The key that opens the door to hell. <laughs> there we go. Go to hell. Let's go. Um, immediately change this. I might get a little bit, uh, talk a little bit less though. One of you viewers might say, oh, finally. But, uh, so I'm getting a bit tired. Because it's uh, quarter past one. Hello, what demon do we have here? Genpaku. Here's the man of the year, George. My name is Genpaku and I'm one of the four demons, the demon of hell. Out of hell, maybe. You did a great job with Kanzo, you granted his wish. That's what we're supposed to do, right? But he didn't eat the soup. These are metaphors, you don't have to be so material about these matters. But back to us, Gonzo is making his consideration to decide what to do with you. Were we too slow with stuff? In the meantime, you must continue to please us, and now my turn has come. <laughs> Filthy bastard. What should I do after the love soup? Do you want the friendship meatloaf, spaghetti or brotherhood? Oh, spaghetti of brotherhood. I like your irony, George. You face a demon from hell and you're being sarcastic. That's why we chose you. You see, George, we demons don't always get along. There are hierarchies to be respected among us. And as you must be imagining, these hierarchies will want to be climbed. Yeah, sure. Yoko, the demon of sins, wants to make my place. Oh, to take my place. The damn bitch stole my book of souls, and if the upstairs find out that I don't have the book anymore, I might even sink lower. Well, they better not find out. Sure. Pretty cool picture. Why don't you take your book yourself? Because I don't have anything that will interest Yoko. But we do. 
And should I have the bargaining chip? Stop asking unnecessary questions, George. You are here for a reason. In the cabinet behind you, you find the green card to get to the Demon of Soul. Since, uh -huh. come back to be to me with the books of souls. All right. I think uh, shit's really starting to hit the fan right now. And the crazy thing is actually, is that I'm playing already for two hours, and I've <laughs> we just did one demon though. That's actually, uh, I think it's going to be a very long game, but I'm not going to split it up into episodes. I'm sorry. Ladies and gentlemen. Um, I'm going to save. Why not? We, we, we did all that stuff. So cool. We have a green key card. We have the chalice. All right. Hang up the chalice. Oh, combined with the chillers. Ah, pretty cool. Nice. Where's the duffel bag? You know what? There it is. Let's put this one away. We don't need it. I'm gonna store that one as well. So, seems like a good idea to do. We need more batteries. One more batteries. Are there more green cards? Alright. Are there more green doors here? Maybe upstairs. That's blue. We still need the blue. That's done. That's done as well. Grandma, grandma's room is done. Alright. I think our room is not done yet. It was a yellow card, right? Oh, why do we need a card? There's so many colors. This is a yellow card. I think it's the only freaking door with the yellow card, though. Let's run for a little bit. How many do we have? Still 15, though. Alright, we should really take, uh, take slow with them. But we can go to the fishy, fishy room. And actually use the purple card here. Hello? Oh, that's not a good sign, man. I'm sorry. February 13, uh, 15, 14, 1983. George and I have decided to get together. Is it a cliche to get together on Valentine's Day? Probably, but I don't care. One day is worth the other because every second spent with George is special. His presence is the only thing that keeps me connected to the house. Taking care of Elsa is difficult and although George has come of age, I don't understand what keeps him tied to this woman. Elsa is evil. She's evil. It has nothing to do with her illness. The other day she kicked the door to my room wide open beside the violent act. It was 2am and I was sleeping. I had a heart attack. Well, welcome, at, welcome at the club, lady. She stood still star staring at me in the dark as, as I tried to compose myself. After almost two minutes of silence and no response to my question of explanation, she acclaimed, a rabbit, that's what animal I, that's what animal I want, a rabbit. I'm starting to get scared. Is it grandma? Oh no. You know what? I should not do this. You have a little bit of light, but I need to see better. Excuse me. Run? Did it say run? Help me. Help me, George. Grandma's coming. <laughs> oh no, we're so fucked. Grandpa? No, you don't you dare, Grandma. Don't you dare, Grandma. Where's the door? Oh shit, there we go, ladies and gentlemen. Grandpa's fucked up. 
Rip was fucked up. Rip was fucked up. Rip, where the f, f are you? We already read this note. Intense, 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 I like it. What's in the office? There are so many rooms in this house. Key to what? Susan's room key. Nice. Finally, we can open that door. What can we do? Oh, shit. Uh, where's the duffel bag? Okay, this would have been a strategic point for a duffel bag, in my opinion, but okay. Wooden plank. Take some force. Oh, this door that wasn't there before. Wait. Door? This is such a long game, holy crap. Door. Uh, we have. We need these cards. Well, we need the pills as well. Susan's room. I'm gonna grab everything that we have. Well, you know what? I'm gonna grab the, quickly the crowbar. Oh. Why is it so bugged out? Oh, okay. All right. That just happened. Let me go quickly back, pick everything up. Not really waste that much. The energy drinks. Toy. Okay, we can do the toys right now. We don't have the key for that. The oil away. Down with the lamp. What's it actually saying? Better. Nothing more here, right? Besides the storage room. Oh, and that, yeah. I think we need the camera again. The joy that had been had been rekindled in me was again extinguished like all things that for a single moment shine was with beauty in my life. I quarreled with Zeus because I defended Grandma. Zeus came to report to me that Grandma threatened her because she saw her, us together and merely said that she shouldn't read too much into what Grandma says. She knows perfectly well that she's sick and not lose it. At the point we started fighting and didn't speak to each other for one whole day. For one day, okay. Laying down the hatch, I decided to take the first step to calm the waters and apologize. I opened the door to Sue's room. She won was gone. Her clothes were gone, her things were gone, and of and of and of my girlfriend, no sign. Grandma says she left because she was no longer comfortable with us. Grandpa killed her. Probably. 100 percent sure. This doesn't convince me, but I live in a difficult situation. I can't force people to stay with me. I say probably, but I'm pretty sure about it, though. Oh, we have a light source. There's no power. Of course not. Um, yeah. Please, flash out. Otherwise, we can't get away. Everything right. Okay, so Susan is gone. It seems. That's pretty cool. Just shit that it bugs out the whole time. Okay, um, we'll go to Sue's room and we're gonna do the toys. And we're gonna take the Polaroid. And first photograph. Alright, then we're gonna check all the other rooms still. That's her. Alright. Have that door to be opened. That's blue key card. Where were the other blue key cards? That's yellow. 
kind of I know that there were more blue key cards to be used. All right, so we open this one quickly. Another, all right. Combine, nice. Let's store this one. And let's go to Susan's room. You know what? Let's store the key cards as well. If we need them, we're gonna grab them. I don't know. I think there was just one purple key card though. Was there? That's blue. Oh, that one was blue as well. Yeah, sure. Let's go into this room. Susan. There, honey. There's also there's a yellow key card. Oh, that's not good. Lay down carrot. All right. I don't know why, but we will. Oh, for the rabbit woman. Is that Susan? Is that Susan, the rabbit woman? Damn it, it's Susan. I did not expect that though. The head of a rabbit costume. G.I. Joe! Batteries, key to what? Storage door room. Alright, let's go there. What is this? The green gem. Alright, can we combine it? It's very valuable. The day be before yesterday, a strange thing happened. It was Halloween, the day, and in front of my room. It was Halloween day, and in front of my room door, there was a big box. Inside it, I found a strange Halloween outfit. I asked George about it, but he said it had nothing to do with this present. There are no, there are not many of us in his house. If it doesn't do it, it narrows the circle by a lot. <laughs> yeah, you got it from Grandma. That's creepy, that thing. Anything else that we... Okay, so we're gonna leave the rep. Okay. <laughs> yeah, done? You done? Fuck's sake. All right. There were no more doors there. Right? No more doors. Oh, wait. There might be something here that we can use. Or a key card, I mean. Why the heck are you sitting here? Yeah, but we all saw that coming, right? Green card. There must be a duffel bag somewhere here. Oh. I just still don't know why we picked up all the oil. We will probably come. Uh, let's store this one. Um, key two. Storage room, we need that. Uh, the key cards. We need the key cards. That's what... Is what I was doing. Nice. You definitely am gonna save one thing though. He took the blue lamp. The blue flame lamp. Ah, that's what we needed. Alright. So, that's why we need the oil. We're gonna bring that with us then. I'm gonna take parts away. I'm gonna save at least once. Let's put the challenge away as well. We don't need it right now. Alright. Hmm. We can put the pills. Back. 
here. Yeah. Yeah. All right. All right. All right. Ah. Okay. So we can go to the storage room real quick. Yeah, no demon. Oh, storage room was here, so right. Now we only need the blue key card, and then we can. I think then we. <laughs> Fucking hell, you got to be kidding me. I have to do everything over I did not save. No! Jesus. No, okay, ladies and gentlemen, I'll see you in a bit. Should have saved, god damn it. Alright, we're a little bit back on track right now. It took me a really, really long time. Um, Replay because I had some trouble here and there. And as you can see, I still have to pick up everything. I still have Sarah's room key. I don't know why, but the door is open already. And I'm gonna save here. Just had to play a couple times over. Maybe there's a duffel bag here. Oh, I think uh, Sarah's dead. Sarah's <laughs> corpse. My rabbit woman, my rabbit woman. Did we hang her up? Oh no. Oh. Let me combine it with this one. Wait, okay, we can make a picture of that. Well, I'm going to. Grab this one real quick. Like it more. And then we go back for a while. For a bit, I mean. Because we still have to do the cubes, the toys upstairs again. So yeah. You know what? Let me take one and two out again door take them all out take the two coins out door this one all right so we are back on track right now you'll just have to grab the other the other red thingy the red gem jesus it took me a li really a long time to play it all over i was about to quit because everything just went completely wrong but I, I said it through, man. Alright, so. We have a red drum. Let's just combine it. I guess. There was one, one is missing. If a green gem. I need the camera, obviously. Of obviously. You know, obviously. Um, yeah, obviously, yeah, we are going to continue right now. Don't get scared, there's a jump scare coming that you already have seen. Boo. <laughs> Let's just put everything up. Alright. Can't remember what I actually was doing in the game. <laughs> That's a sad thing now right now. I we were busy with the demons, I know. We don't have to go there anymore. I, I've grabbed everything that we need. Go back here. From now on, it's all new jump scares. There's something here. Oh, we have to pick up this knife. Susan's lifeless body. The death is also my fault. Jesus. Let's read it, maybe. To anyone f finds this letter, help. Elsa keeps me locked up in this cell after beating me into unconsciousness. I woke up here without windows, stairs. The days are all the same. I have completely lost all sense of time. Even now and then the lady comes to feed me. Carrots. Every day, carrots. She says I'm here a little rabbit. 
I'm her little rabbit. She always wanted the rabbit and now she has one in the cage. Screaming doesn't help. I don't think George can hear me. I don't understand why he doesn't come looking for me. Well, he thinks you're gone, mate. However, I will not stop screaming. As long as my lungs have breath, I will keep calling for help as long as someone can hear me. I'm afraid, Susan. Well, that helped. I hope the thing is now on, actually, the nudity filter, so I might cut out the part that we saw the... <laughs> All right. How many saves do we still have? We have four. I want to do that all over again. Oh, save there. And now we're going to save the saves. <laughs> um. All right. We did. Oh, that's what I was doing there. Jesus. I need the lamp, right? Examine. Well, what do I have to do here? I'm gonna write that down though because I think it's hard. Is one? Oh, that's the code for. Oh, yeah, for the demon. So where's the second one then? We don't need that stuff. Did not need to save it all. Examine. Somewhere up there, alright. Put away. So different with the lamp. Um, let's take all the photographs out because we don't need this stuff right now. Makes it easier. Where's. That it goes quickly though. Lam lantern. That's a two. I'm gonna just draw it over. There's two. I hope we have to find the code like this. Because it can also be that. Alright. Okay. We we need the we need the symbol. Where's the third one? Ah, grandma's room. So long, holy crap. Well, yeah, not really actually, because I've been playing for a long, long time. Um, because I had to play everything over. So, this symbol we know this already is three. I have to do my headset for a sec. I'll be back. We didn't have a jump scare in a long time. Hello, you're back. I see. I think this is also wrong because he's supposed to be. Supposed to be gone, I think. He just came back and the key never never really disappeared. The Susie's room key. Sin is five. Why sin? I don't get that. What? Okay, there needs to be a symbol there. Where is this? Oh, alright. That's, I know, that's Going about here somewhere. There needs to be a symbol here. Right? Because, yeah, that's. Where's it supposed to be then? Oh, uh, the lamp's empty. Maybe that's, that's the reason. There it is. Star. I think something went wrong with the game, ladies and gentlemen. Sid needs to be a symbol. Alright, let's go to the Black Lotus box. He's still sitting there, though. I hope we're almost done, though. But I still don't. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. The three demons. I think this is also a mask. Uh, there it is. Bedlock locks the opening. 
Ah, Shin is okay. Alright. Go cursor. One is hard. Oh, we went over it. And two is I. And three, uh, three was. The, 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 so Dylan, uh, Poseidon, Fork. Then we have four, it was the triangle. Then we had Sin. And then we had a. What was it? The star. Yes. It's open. Nice. Let's bring it to her. The new thing is on. The lotus flower. Thank you, George. I've been waiting for it. And you need it for? Nothing that concerns you. Now get out of here. I still need the book, you woman. Wait, the book of souls. Not gonna give it. Are you really that stupid, George? I didn't become the demon of sins because of my honesty. Ha ha ha. Shoot her, please. But I have to. You have to do nothing. You get yourself in this situation. Now get lost. Alright. You say so. Um. Yeah, bro, what? Uh, <laughs> excuse me, woman. I would like to have my, my, my book. Because otherwise, I really don't know what to do then. All right. How can I know you? There must be something here that we can do. Oh wait, maybe we can just actually go to the demon himself. Okay. And so the demon of sins has tricked you. Nothing new under the sun. Oh, you scared me. I'm sick and tired of that damn demon. I don't know what the what cock she's sucking to stay in her hierarchy. <laughs> I still don't understand. I still don't understand why I have to do with this whole thing. Dear George, you are the key to everything. We demons are immortal, of course. But there are things far worse than death. If Yoko fooled you, we will fool her. <sighs> Come on. Get the blue card of the cabinet behind you and retrieve the mysterious conco concoction. Alright. Now what is the mysterious concoction is what George asked. This is a formulation of my own creation. Retrieve it, go to purgatory and correct Gonzo's love suit with my conco concoction. Right? Does Yoko want her heart, heart back? Great, we will give it back to her. This will give you time to retrieve my book. Now go, George. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Now we have finally the blue card. I expect some jump scare still. There's a blue card here. Safe card. Right, what is wrong with these knives, though? we need to do with it? There's a blue card here. Oh, you still need, still need the yellow card though. We have so many light sources, it's insane. We have so many batteries, I mean. Use some. Okay, we have that though. Blue key card. Or was there another blue key card? There was one more, right? You know what? We're gonna just go. And we'll see what happens. Three, four saves. We save one more time here. Open everything here. Okay, now we fooled. Akpo, Akko. Well, why did they make her naked? I don't know why you should do that, man. The 
it doesn't improve the experience at all. Okay, she walked in here. But she's not there. Sure. Where's the Book of Souls now? I don't get it. Did we do it? Oh. Oh. We need to run, I guess. Just run forward, man. We found the book. We found her mask. <laughs> nice. Uh, where is he? Need the book. All right. Um. Here. 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 You go. Oh, he's gone. Oh no, he's gone as well. Yellow key card, or oh, we can do that now. All right, yellow key card was her room and upstairs. Susan's room and what's the other one? I'm scared. I'm scared. No, no. We. Key to small key. A small key that opens the counter door. What door was that then? There's one next to the storage room. I know where that is. All right. Need a lot of toilet paper. It seems we're gonna shit our pants. And actually. The chillers right now. Combine it one more time. All right. You have this green thingy. I think that we need to. We don't need this one anymore. I don't think we need. No. Door this one. Doors. Well, I don't think we need it anymore. Bring the daggers. With three gems. All right. Combine. You do okay. We can do that right now. We can give the, to the statue. But let's, let's also go to the storage room first. I'm scared, please. I mean, this. Okay, so that doesn't open. Then I want a small key that opens the counter door. What is the counter door? What was the counter door? I can't remember there was still a door locked somewhere. A dead door, but I assume that's not it. Right, all the masks. This statue just went away into paradise. Um, you have three saves. I'm gonna save. <laughs> Maybe we can do all the endings. No, nah, I'm not gonna do that. It's way too long already for me. The counter door. What? Oh, maybe you mean this one. Ah, then just call it the electricity box, man. Read carefully. Yoko, Kanpaku. Okay, so... I don't know what happens if we pick it up. But do we have still stuff to do? No. 
No, I think so, right? I think we're completely almost go. Uh, blah, 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 blah. We almost went through the game. But maybe we, I can actually read a little bit like this. Examine. Cancer, the demon of purgatory. Offer their carrot to the demon of purgatory. Zeus's life will be spared. You will have a chance to start over from your teenage years and save your uh, save your first true love. Offer me the carrot, and in return, I will give you Elsa's heart. We offer we offering your second chance, George. By saving Zeus, you won't fall into the spiral of alcoholism. I'm doing so. You won't meet Hannah and destroy your family with Dora's death. By making this offer, you will not be able to make other, any others. Alright. Alright, so... Cool. Yoko. Offer Danny's book to the Demon of Sins. There are no second chances, George. What's done is done. If you decide to return your life... Return to your life, you have to, d to deal with Danny. Anna's brother. He wants revenge and sooner or later he will find you. Offer me his book. I will take care of him. Okay. Offer me the book and in return I will give you Danny's heart. That's pretty cool because that's actually the brother of the whole first game. Offer Grandmother's steed to the demon of hell. Apologizing after slap doesn't erase the pain. You look the other way after she's Susan disappeared and didn't try hard enough to look for her. But you can still redeem yourself. Offer me Elsa's steed and in return I will give you Susan's heart. Okay, so... As I understood it correctly. Offer me the character and in return I will give you Elsa's heart. Oh, Elsa's my grandmother, right? Susan's life will be spared. You will have the chance to start over from your teenage years. But we still have then... Our... You know, messed up childhood. Offer grandma's tea of demon of hell. Offer me Elsa's tea and in return I will give you Susan's heart. By sacrifice Susan, you can save Laura. Love her. Heh. Alright. So, but it says Susan's heart, but let me save Laura. By getting rid of Danny, you eliminate everything that ties you to the past and be able to move forward peacefully. Alright. What was the first one then? I know I have to read the other last one as well. By saving Susan, you won't fall into the spiral of alcoholism. In doing so, you won't meet Hannah and destroy your family with Laura's death. So, then we don't have to meet Danny as, as well. He saved Sara and her daughter, or her sister. What's this one? By accepting who you are, what you've done in your past, you will be able to lead a normal life. Offer the green gem to the demon haven. You have been through a lot, George. It's time to acknowledge your mistakes. Accept them and move on. We have gone through your entire past. You're not a murderer. You're just an unfortunate victim of events. So, okay, we can save our own ass. And actually, I think still, still all the things happen. Then we can, um, by sacrificing Susan, you can st save Laura, love for love. Offer me Elsa's tea and in return I will give you Susan's heart. But this doesn't, this one doesn't make sense in my opinion. Offer me the book and I will give you in return. You're offering you, getting rid of Danny. I think this is actually, this is what actually the, tr the true good one by saving susan you won't fall into the spire of alcoholism so if we save susan we have still have a happy life but we still have our net we, we still have our nasty child but we can grow over it we won't lose susan we won't get an alcoholism we won't meet laura laura is still have a family this one just helps with laura's family but just by eliminate danny we don't want to save Laura, because if we do this one, we automatically save Laura, right? And in return, I will give you your heart. So, what happens... Wait. Does it make it... Wait. So, these two ones are the, actually the right ones to choose. Because he said you won't fall into... So we get back to life. I'm, I'm going for this one. I'm going for the for the carrot. Yeah, I'm going for the carrot. Because if we just save ourselves, everyone is still dead. I'd like to have a good ending. Because yeah, I can show you, of course, all of them. 
Well, we can grab the book, right? Hey, what book does he mean actually? With the green gem. Where's the carrot? It's upstairs. Carrot is upstairs, right? Yeah. Carrot. Pretty cool game with all the three. It doesn't come off the plate. Oh my lord. Oh my lord. You bloody fucking wankers. I can't take the carrot. Oh, that makes me. That makes me upset, man. That's mean. Why giving me the choice then? Why haven't I learned from it yet? The book. The book. Oh, I can't grab the book. Oh, we can't grab anything. Now we're screwed. We have to choose this one. I don't have the carrot. I don't have the book. I don't have the tea. I can just... Oh, but I wanted to... I wanted to do this one. Okay, so ladies and gentlemen. We all choose this one. But I have to choose this one to end the game. Oh, I should have saved, but yeah, I don't, I don't care. Just a little bit of a scene though. Well, I would have saved Susan and actually saved all of it. But my name is Mishun and I'm the demon of heaven. <gasps> Ooh. You've made your choice. Yeah. Couldn't have been easy, but now here you are. In front of your heart, you have chosen. Fill it with the daggers and take it to the corresponding demon. You have been one of the most interesting pawns of the last century, so you deserve the truth. There is no such thing as the second chances. <laughs> Alright. Take my soul and save everyone else. Just as there is no such thing as free will in a world populated by omniscient beings like us demons. When you know the past, the present and the future, it's, huge. it's natural to come to the conclusion that there is no such thing as free will. Alright. Political. <laughs> but nevertheless, even though we knew what you would choose, you made your own decision. We just enjoyed making your path interesting. Well, you, you guys did a good job. I have to say that with three parts. From the moment you came into the world, we already knew your destiny. Well, if we're gonna play the ultimate part, I know I'm gonna save those parts though. Are you destined to, cha are you destined to change the things? Did we give you a second chance? No, you didn't. Yet, you will never know. Free will does not exist when you are omniscient. Omni I don't know. Life itself is nothing but a the uh, theater in which every action is performed following the script. We demons are in charge arranging the set. Us demons is right. A medicine in the right place. A dull place properly. A riddle to be solved. And it all takes shape in what seems like the randomness of life of the programming of a video game. What? Now you know the truth, George. It will be up to you to choose how you decide to live your future. Well, I decided, right? That's pretty cool. Well... He said I can still choose, right? Can I just... What is the choice here? Is there somewhere else that I can be? Nah, right? We made our choice. We made our choice. Alright. So be As I was saying about the ultimate game, if we're gonna play it in a couple of weeks, I'm gonna remind myself, I'm gonna write it down on a piece of paper, I'm gonna remind myself that we shouldn't put everything on a thing, right? Everything on a plate. We can, s otherwise we can't make choices. There we go. We picked up George Hart and we saved ourselves. 
Is the door open? There we go. The exit door has been opened. I don't know exactly where it is. And then one big jump scare still coming. Watch it. It's so mean with the... We can't make our own choices if you just put it on. We should have taken it... The possibility had to take it back though. Well ladies and gentlemen, after three and a half hours, I'm finally done with the third part. Holy crap, what a game. Some good scares. Finally concluded the story. Nice puzzles. Hard game, but I also took a little break in the meantime. You won't see that, of course. Because it was really warm in this room. I have to bring my girlfriend to bed. She likes it when I tuck her in. Um, yeah, and then I went back. Then the game got busted. I had to play three times over. Yeah, so I, I'm curious how long this game is actually for you here. I hope about two hours. But I think maybe two and a half hours. Pretty long game. I hope you enjoy it. Let me know what you think, ladies and gentlemen. I'm not saying that much more right now. Because I enjoyed it. That good scares. I completely enjoyed the whole trilogy. And I can't wait to play Ultimate in a couple weeks when this sink in a little bit. So that we don't know. It might have the same scares in the beginning. We're at this game, so uh, I'm gonna sink, let this game sink in a little bit and then we're gonna play it in a couple weeks. Maybe when it's a little bit on the sale, because 15 euros for the, the games that we already played is a lot. Um, yeah, let's see what's at the end of the hallway. I guess nothing though. I'm curious. Oh, there is something. Alright. That's still Laura's room. I'm going nuts though. Just why did every game end in Laura's room? Ooh, I should have thought about that. George apartment. <gasps> Georgie. But what key? Why is it ominous out of nowhere? Alright. But let us open it. Italian, I guess. Your journey has come to an end, but it's only the beginning of the new life. You have chosen to start your life over from the end. It doesn't erase the terrible child and frightening adolescence. Adoles 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 and <clears throat> your experience just as doesn't erase the fact that because of you, Laura didn't. Laura died and Hannah committed suicide. You simply accepted it and it didn't take your own life. Mind you, George, you didn't become a better person, but you have a chance to become one with the knowledge of your mistakes. When you leave this room, you have no memory of it, us and what happened. Your story is about to begin again. Knowledge is not free. Erasing your memory is necessary to give you the illusion of having autonomous choices. Good luck, George. To see you soon, the four demons. I appreciate it because I think Ultimate is the game is going to give us the same kind of vibe. Um... We don't need this stuff anymore. We're gonna get the same kind of vibe um, as this game and this game, and then a little bit different story each set, and then we're done. The end, ladies and gentlemen. Well, yeah, we will see. I'm rambling on. I'm done with the game. I'm done for today. It's three and a half hours later, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for watching. I appreciate it. If you're new and you're still watching and you're appreciating me, leave a like, subscribe, of course. If you're still watching, if you really like my work, if you really like me and the games that I play. You can check out the description. You can buy me coffee after this. I really need that. But ladies and gentlemen, as I always say, I love y'all. Thank you for watching. And I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.